Good. Is this Mr. Bickle's home? I believe so. He supposedly has evidence against Harlow. We need to speak with him. My husband! What will I do? Are you all right? We're looking for Mr. Bickle. My husband? Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mrs. B Theophilus Harlow! I'm sure of it. He's been threatening my husband. I don't mean to be grim, but could Harlow have taken... Archie's satchel is missing, so he may have left on his own. I hope he wasn't here when Harlow... Do you know which way Archie might have gone? He never wanders far. But if he witnessed Harlow doing something to his father... Uh, I'm afraid to leave, in case he comes back home. We'll find your son, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. <laughs> what am I going to do? <laughs> Please do not worry, Mrs. Bickle. We will bring Achi home. When I took the letter we found to Officer Singer, she told me about Mr. Bickle. He had been doing the same thing we had, providing Officer Singer with evidence to put down Harlow. I had hoped to speak with him about what he had found, but we were too late. What did Officer Singer say about the letter you brought her? She thanked me, but she clearly felt that it was not enough. It is a shame that hippogriffs cannot speak. Your friend Highwing could provide all the evidence against Harlow that we need. We will need something more. This must be little Archie's hideout that Mr. Bickle mentioned. Archie? Archie Bickle! He would not have done this to his own hideout. Someone came here looking for him. Revelio may be our only hope of finding out which way he went. There! Archie's footprints. He went this way. I thought we would have found Archie by now. I suspect he'll keep running if he's being followed. If it is Harlow that's pursuing him, I only hope you're right. Men like Harlow would not think twice about killing a child. We must find Archie. Look around. Rebellion. Archie Satchel. Why would he leave it behind? He was likely running from Harlow, distracted. This may be a good time for Revelio again. Archie went this way. I have a bad feeling about this. Harlow must have a reason for pursuing Archie. I wonder what Archie saw. I hope he didn't see Harlow kill his father. He would never overcome it. At least not in any way I can imagine. A fork in the road. We will need Revelio again. Revelio. Multiple sets of footprints. Oh, Harlow caught up to him here. This is not good. They went this way. <sighs> Thirst 
Strauss. They are beautiful, are they not? You can see Thestrals too. I witnessed death when I was nine. Rebellion. So my first I found comfort in it. I still do. Rebellion. I think those of us who have witnessed death deserve some comfort. I'm sorry you experienced something like that at so young an age. I was with my father when he died. My mother was away, and I felt quite helpless. It was a long time ago in some ways, but in other ways, it seems like it was only yesterday. I still see him so clearly. You must miss him. My father was a wonderful man. I... <clears throat> Let us keep moving. We must find Archie. what they deserved. Revelio. To be so large on the inside, that complicates things a little. Don't think he saw it happen, dear. Revelio. He's just a child. We should release him. This is the sort of thing that could try to tell us and decide what to do with him once he gets back. <clears throat> Revelio. Archie. Archie Bickle. How do you know who I am? Your mother sent us to find you. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. Not too loud, Archie. Sorry. We need to get this open. Alohomora. Am 
man called Harlow. He killed my father. We're so sorry, Archie. We won't let him get away with it. But first, we need to get you home to your mother. Thank you for saving me. We wouldn't have it any other way, Archie. Now, let's get you home. We know a safe way back. friends are in danger. I heard the people who took me talking about them. Which friends, darling? Mr. and Mrs. Rabe. Mr. Filbert. And I think they also said Otto's name. Oh. I shall speak with them. You run inside. Yes, Mother. Your husband's friends may be in danger. Just as he was. How can we help? You've done enough. My husband was a powerful wizard and couldn't defeat Harlow. The last thing we need is that monster coming after you. It may be too late for that. I'm afraid Harlow's already after us. Then you needn't anger him further. I assure you, the threat could be a lot worse. Please, please keep your distance. I'm sorry again about your husband, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. And thank you for bringing Archie home. I can never repay the two of you for your kindness. Not to worry, Mrs. Bickle. My father used to say that rain does not fall on one roof alone. We are here to help each other. I must learn more about Mr. Bickle's friends and why Harlow is after them. You'll be hearing from me as soon as I know something. Thank you for your help today. I can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented... Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. Who lived here, I wonder? Hogsmeade, here I come. This must be Tobbs's cave. I suppose 